you could say that the amber type is actually a sort of a historical mistake because an amber type is essentially an underexposed collodion negative. I just wish all mistakes were that beautiful. Very quickly the amber type started making a career in its own right because people realized that the silver image on a black metal plate or a black glass plate is exceedingly beautiful, comparable maybe with the daguerreotype. Preparing a wet plate amber type is basically the same as a collodion negative. We first coat a glass plate with a thin layer of sorted collodion, immediately sensitized, exposed and developed. The image that we see after development will be a negative image. Once this is fixed, it becomes clear, the collodion layer becomes transparent. Once dry, this becomes almost perfectly white. However, this white will soon disappear once the collodion is varnished. It will again turn slightly yellowish, slightly creamy because of the color of the varnish that will resemble the wet plate directly out of the fixer.